Oh, hi there. Sissy, it's nice to meet you. Oh, hello, Dr. Nielsen. It's very nice to meet you too. Yeah, Sissy is an interesting name. W where did that come from? Oh, I'm Sissy because I'm a big sister. I have adorable twin siblings, a brother and a sister. Oh, well, that's nice. What, what, what's your real name? Sissy. No, no, no. You, you said that's your big sister nickname. What's your birth name? You know, before you were a big sister. Sissy. Uh, uh, is, um, is, is, is Sissy short for something? Sister? I'm just gonna, um, <laughs> so um, what are your memories before y you were a big sister? Well, let's, let's see. My first memory is 1966 when my brother and sister and I moved in with our uncle and his gentleman's gentleman. Uh -huh. and, and how old were you? Uh, about 15. Okay, your, your first memory is age 15? Well, actually I'm wrong. Uh. I'm still 15, but my first memory is a catchy theme song. Uh, a, a, a theme song. Mm -hmm. Well, a tune, really. No words, just, well. It's, it's always kind of stuck in my head. You know, like one of those worms. And not just me. People hum my theme song around me all the time. Uh huh. I'm just gonna, just gonna. Okay. Um. So, um. <laughs> what? Why don't you tell me about your brother and sister? Well, they were adorable, real scene stealers, if you know what I mean. I don't. What do you mean? Well, they always got to say the cute things, and. When we were at the dinner table, I'd let them have the good seats. I sat in the lousy one where most of the time you could just see the back of my head. Who saw the back of your head? I don't know. Also, they had freckles and sometimes a missing tooth. Have you ever had to compete with freckles? Not that I'm aware of. Well, I don't recommend it. Plus, I'm cursed with excellent teeth. So what's a girl to do? <laughs> uh, I'm not sure. Doctrine. That's what. A smart, trendy dress will always get you a nice close-up. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Fashion? Close-up. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, uh, you know, let, let's just let's back up for a minute. Um, why did you and your siblings move in with your uncle? And his gentleman's gentleman. Uh, and his gentleman's gentleman. Well, it's sad. And my family didn't really do sad. Now, don't get me wrong. We <laughs> knew how to milk a good tender moment. That's for sure. But life is more of a comedy, don't you think? <sighs> like with family values on top like a cupcake with sprinkles. Oh, oh that's good. Let's go with that. Uh, life, life is like a, like a, like a cupcake. Uh, don't forget the sprinkles. That's the best part. With sprinkles. Uh -huh. um, so um, tell me about your uncle. Oh, he was the best. Very handsome, and kind, and smart too. Well, it sounds like you two had a, a, a healthy relationship. We did. And the only thing we ever truly fought about was dating. Whenever I tried to come home a minute past 10, oh, oh, oh brother. He had strict rules about dating? Oh, did he? I was only allowed to go out when it wasn't a school night. I confess, when I was a teenager, I was resentful. But as an adult, I've grown to see the wisdom in a good night's sleep. And now I keep the same rule for myself, only two nights a week for dates. Okay, well, are you, are you seeing someone special? Well, Dr. Nielsen, I believe 
everyone is special in their own way. So when a nice boy, oh, now man, asks me out, I say, yes. So let's see, two dates a week, 52, 55 years. It's, uh, I have been on 5,720 dates. Oh, wait, wait, wait. One, one time I had the flu. So 5,719. Five, five, five thousand seven hundred and nineteen dates with 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 five thousand seven hundred and nineteen different guys. Well, no, silly. Sometimes I date the same guy a few times in a row. Until. Until what? Until he wants me to cook him dinner, then I have to dump him. Why? I don't know how to cook. Our gentleman's gentleman did that. I don't do laundry either, but I know how to shop. So I just eat out and buy new clothes. My uncle's gentleman's gentleman comes over and does a cleaning for me on his lunch hour. Still? How old is he? Oh. Well, let's see, he's, um, oh, he'll be 103 this year. <sighs> he's a little forgetful, but surprisingly spry for his age. And to this day, he still dresses like he's about to meet the Queen of England when he vacuums. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh -huh. Mrs. Beasley. Who's Mrs. Beasley? She's the reason I wanted to see you. Oh, well then, well, tell me about Mrs. Beasley. You won't think I'm terrible. <laughs> I, I am not here to think you're, you didn't, didn't kill her, did you? Oh, no, but I did drop her a few times on her head. To be honest, I, I kind of enjoy throwing her around. Okay, I'm just gonna, uh, Okay, I, I, uh, <laughs> um, I must warn you that although we do have a, a, a doctor-patient confidentiality, uh, that is nullified if I learn of a crime. Dr. Nielsen, Mrs. Beasley is my sister's doll. Oh, I see. Okay, we're just gonna, gonna <laughs> erase. Uh, you know, it would have been helpful if you had led with that. Um, okay, so uh, why are you upset with a doll? Well, she's the one everyone remembers. Whenever I talk about my childhood, people interrupt me and said, oh, I remember Mrs. Beasley. Oh, I had her. Oh, blah, blah, and blah, 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 blah. Every conversation leads to that darn doll. I was the best big sister in the whole wide world. I was so good, I make myself sick. But does anybody remember that? Do they? Do they? I'm guessing no. <laughs> You're darn tootin' no. It's like I'm a supporting character in my own life story. Okay, cute, freckle-faced twins. I can't understand a little but no amount of snappy dressing could keep me from getting up stage by a doggone hunk of plastic in a polka dot dress and god darn granny glasses. Okay. <sighs> oh, phew. Well, excuse my, my colorful language, but it sure felt good to get that off my chest. Well, <sighs> that, that's, that's why I'm here. <laughs> Well, thank you, thank you, thank you, all cured. And I got to sit in the chair where everyone can see my face. And, oh, there is still time to go to Macy's. Oh, they're having a sale. Well, thank you, thank you so much, Dr. Nielsen. This really was fun. <laughs> Gotta run. <sighs> First memory was a theme song. <laughs> Upstaged by a doll. 5,719 dates. <sighs> the
Oh, great. Now she's got me singing a song, too. Oof. 